Well, what are we working on today, Tubbs? Junk. Junk. <laughs> the Dodge is in the shop again. The 2013 Ram 1500, we're gonna do a CV shaft on her. Yeah, I'd say she's bad. <laughs> That's seven aces of lugs. First step, caliper. Gonna be this guy and that guy right there. Oh. I'll get you a zip tie so we can tie it up. Okay, the next step is to take the axle nut off. And it's an inch and seven sixteenths. And we got the Milwaukee with a half inch and three quarter inch adapter. See if you'll do it. We might need to get a bar though, right here. So we, so the, so she don't spin when she, when we're taking it off. That's why we zip tied it. <laughs> so after you get the axle nut off, we're gonna take the tire out off, and we're gonna take the um, ball joint loose so this whole spindle comes down. I came loose. <laughs> I don't think I've seen that before. Just gotta whack that lower ball joint as much as you can and the hub will drop. Now we should just be able to pull the CV right out of the diff. She coming? I don't think so. She's kind of fighting us. Oh, there she comes. Got her. That was a bitch. There's a new CD right there, ready to go. Is it going? There she goes. She's in. Okay. So, this is a tricky part. We're going to have to put the hub up while putting the CV in while lining up with the ball joints. Oh, oh shit. So, you can get Sorry. that in. Let's, uh, Line the shaft. Well, no, I think we have to go boss first. Right? Let me try to line the shaft up. There we go. Okay. Should we touch some? Yep. Okay. Can we take a break or no? 
Is this is it actually in the splines? Yeah, it looks like it. Okay. You probably want to do the top bolting first so you don't put all that stress on that tire rod. You know what I'm saying, Bruno? Let's try it out. I think. 